Legend of Total War here with part 14 of my Mount and Blade Warband Anno Domini 1257 Let's Play campaign as Legend of the Conqueror. Previously we fought a pretty massive battle, well, large battle near Verona, defeated the Holy Roman Empire there, uh, across a number of smaller engagements as well, and then we decided since they had basically no forces left, now's the time to press the attack. We conquered Basil, all my, um, all my armies, all my uh, generals have all joined me in the campaign. It's good they've actually been loyal. Because I know I, in the previous Mountain Blade uh, campaign, it was hard to get these fuckers to do anything with me. But now they're actually doing shit. Um, so yeah, next step is Bonheim. Anything we can do to weaken the Holy Roman Empire is good. Okay, so this is a castle at this time. And they've also recently been fighting the Holy Road, oh, not the Holy Road, the Poland and uh, Hungary, so that's probably why they're not in the best of shape. Yeah, but they're regretting not fucking calling for peace. I'm not giving these settlements back, motherfuckers, they'll have to take it. If you have a look at them, they're still stronger than us. We've got a lot of territory. We're starting to catch up, because we've got basically all of this general area here. We don't have Venice, though. Alright, now we should have about 600 men for this assault. Just guessing. So we're up against 400, so unless things go absolutely shit, we should be okay. Interesting. That's not a ladder, but whatever. I'll take it. It's Lord Martin... Martin Martin's Machado. God, what a silly name. It's knocked out. Okay, this should be a little bit easier than ladders. Uh, fuck. Yep, said it was going to be easier than ladders. Wrong. My guy's just going to push me off the wall. I think I've got to help out by getting rid of these archers. Because they're just going to fucking destroy my guys as they're coming over there. I'll come up on the second wave. Be up there sh shooting, not from down here. Okay. How are we going so far? Not well. We've lost a hell of a lot more than they have. We just gotta get break through this first part, I think. Once we break through there, we should be able to start turning the tide, I think. All these damn Crossbows can't be helping my situation. Motherfuckers. Don't dodge my shot, bitch. Well, they're only giving me option for a headshot, so fucking take a headshot. See, with the uh, the crossbows going down, the kill ratio is starting to rise back in our favour. I need to get up on the side of the wall. Fuck, don't get in my way. Motherfucker. Now I'm stuck. difficult with banners in the way. Seems to have cleared them off. Okay, here we going now. 
Uh, we're definitely not winning. As far as kill ratio is concerned, we've lost a lot of men. That's it. It's okay if this takes multiple assaults. It's just, I prefer it just to be one, obviously. I don't think I could jump from there to there, I just don't think it would work. Oh well, no guts, no glory. Like I said. Alright guys, hold this position here. Because what we're doing there isn't working, so we need to come up with another approach if we want to win on this particular assault. And we've got plenty of men, but it would like to be able to continue attacking after this as well. Alright, I got an idea. I'm going to set them to charge now, and I am going to jump across over here through enemy lines. arches that were I couldn't bloody see before. Okay, it seems to be going a little bit better now. One guy is fucking beating me. Yeah, what are you do with that shield? Now you fucking cunt moustache, you dick. How much damage you did to me? Oh well. Okay, now if I get on the other side here, I should be able to carve them up. If these guys don't turn around, we're gonna get ourselves a lot of kills. This is what I'm talking about. Alright, so how'd that turn the tide? Uh, the kill ratio is still not good, but you know, it helped a little bit. Hmm. Now, once again, I can't reach them. I have an idea. Just jump down here first, and then here. Try and flank them from this angle. There's archers up there, but I reckon if I went and fought them, they'd kill me. Oh, 
Opportunity to, to fuck them up like that again. So we've we've haven't even killed half of them yet. That being said, we've actually killed more of them than we've lost, as in dead. So what I might do is withdraw and prepare the ladders to attack again, just so I can I want to be involved in it, and that gives my wounded uh, a chance to recover. Let them raid, doesn't matter. Well, it does matter, but... Oh shit, there's a lot of troops lost. It's like ten of them. Oh, no hookers for you then, bitch. Alright, we should still have plenty to assault this with, because there's only, what, 250 men left? Well, that's what I've got, just by myself. But we do need to get a good kill ratio. Alright, let's go. Hey, guys. Hold the position there. Because hmm. I gotta get across. So if my guys could just sit there, I know they'll take some damage, but. Just keep them distracted, oh, motherfuckers. If I can get across there and start carving them up, then we'll get them to charge again. So I just need an area so I can jump across. I just need that to be cleared. Problem is, without those guys here... Oh, fuck's sake. Alright, I'm going to have to get them to charge. Just to distract them so I can clear up all these ar goddamn archers. So far, I think the kill ratio has been pretty good, but I've taken too much damage. I'm more important than my soldiers, after all. <clears throat> Fuckers. As long as my guys don't get in my way. Which they probably will. Close to his fucking shield. I think it's gonna be hard to hit him from there. Alright, once again. I think it's easy to be jumping off. And trying to push through them. Okay, once again, hold your position down here. I just need a bit of time to clear off all those archers. Alright, how are we going now? We're going fantastically well, but it doesn't have to go that that well. It's a little bit harder to assault than I thought it would. Come on, get off, I need to get up there. Motherfuckers. Alright, I gotta get them further back here. Let me get up there first. The problem is I just can't push these guys out of the way. Right, so we got we got to jump across, which could be difficult. Shit. Yep, that's gonna be difficult. Mm, fuck's sake! Well, I'm wounded, so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna withdraw. We'll try again. Party loses 11 morale. Give a shit. Okay, didn't actually cost me as much as I thought it would, but still, it's pretty pricey.
None of that stuff helps us. Prosperity is going down because of that fucking asshole, but whatever. I mean, we could go and raid some of these settlements around here, but... I don't know. I'm more interested in winning the war rather than making money. Hopefully we can win this time. What the fuck did that guy do? Coming down here, whatever. Okay, once again, gotta clear off all these damn crossbow units. shots as I can. Because it's quicker. I need to kill around the other side, but I can't let shoot at it. Well, now I can. How are we going? We're doing okay. We're not fantastic, but we're doing okay. I mean, if we need to pull back to get some more troops, it's not the end of the world. I mean, I do have plenty of money. And my guys don't even pay for their troops anyway. They just need to regenerate them. God, yes, charge in there. jump to that one there where the sword tip is. I'd have to jump through there. Or there. I could possibly jump through there. Let's just wait for a few more guys of mine to fall over. Maybe I can jump it, but then again reinforcements will be coming soon. They'll start crowding around, making it impossible for me to jump through. Go for it. No, I'll never make that jump. Fuck, right. Hold this position, losers. Oh, god damn it. Oh, I hate it when this happens. Get fucking stuck. Sometimes I want to be able to fucking kill my guys, kick him off the fucking thing. That's not gonna work. Maybe it will. Not really. This is a hard one to fight, just logistically. It's hard for me to get in there and do anything. I don't know what commands I could possibly do to make it. Make them fight any better. I mean, this is the only entry into the city. Or is it? I want to go have a look. Maybe I shouldn't have jumped off there. There's not going to be some sort of magical entrance, I think. 
Nothing over there. I wish I could tell my reinforcements to cool it. Because I could jump across that now. If I could bloody get over there, that is. Come on, a few more guys, just get over there. Damn it. Fucking reinforcements. Motherfuckers! Guy pushed me just as I was going over there. Hold this position, everyone come down here. I need to get across. If I can't get up there, we're not gonna win this. Makes a huge difference if I'm attacking the flanks. Okay, there it is, it's got an opening. I gotta make it while my guys are fighting there. Those. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Charge again, because I'm through now. Clear the archers off here, then we'll come back and just do what we did before. Just try and dodge these as. Okay, get over there, good. Time to do the butcher's work. Good. Have to get around their back. Alright, I'm getting down here. I think I'll go up there and uh, fight off those archers. Because that fight there seems to be going okay. I mean, I'm up on the walls now. I just want to stop these guys from shooting me in the back as I'm fighting. Did I miss anyone? I don't think so. Damn it. Any archers that come around this way, carve them up. Good. I think we'll get we'll do it this time. Kill ratio is not too bad. How many men do I have left? Should still have a few. There's more guys coming in over here. Okay, this is going to be a problem. I'm about to be sandwiched. Jump down there so I don't lose any health. <laughs> Fuck do you think you're doing, you dumb cunt? Goes back there, I can still still see some shooting at me, but they're too far away for me to really be concerned about them. Okay, we must be nearing the end of the battle because there's only 21 men left, and they don't seem to have any more reinforcements coming. Come on, you idiots, charge. So now it's just the stragglers. Hmm, there's the gate. 
Oh, well, I'll know for next time, I guess. Might have been easier to come through there. And there's still a lot of them here. Oh, we'll make do. Slice their legs right off. If you could actually decapitate them, that would be awesome. Thank fuck, I finally got this. Alright, good. And this will recover our losses as well by taking all this shit. So it didn't matter if we... It wasn't 100% efficient. Here we go. Just get all these troops back. I'm sure there's some good units in here that I'm probably going to miss, but I really don't care. As far as I'm concerned, numbers is good enough. Some people argue differently, just say, Oh, you know, you got to get the best troops ever. But I don't know. The way my brain works in this particular game, I don't think that's, that's necessary. I think it's more important to just hire lots and lots of units, just keep using them, put them out in the fields, keep fighting, losing them, keep fighting. It worked really well for me in the other campaign, at least. Some people will disagree, but I don't give a shit. It, it worked. Oh, I just didn't quite have enough, that's okay. And there's never going to be anything in there that's going to be useful for me. Okay, I have to defer the appointment. There's not much we can do here. If we go to the Lord's Hall, what's this? Whatever, I don't give a shit. Okay, there's 92 men there. So what have we taken? With Sponheim, what else did we get from that? We've got this settlement, that settlement there is attached to it. it seems kind of far off, but whatever. Alright, now these guys here are pretty diminished. Look at that, they got... we're gonna have to call off the, the campaign, I think. Let them go home and recover. i just start upgrading all my heroes. Let them go home. Okay, I'm going to go back to Verona and assign Basil to me. I can always give it away to someone else later if the tax inefficiency goes up too high. I'm not too sure about Sponheim. Uh-oh. Uh, they're not interested in fighting us. I can ignore them. Wait, what are you doing? It's supposed to be. Oh shit, I'm gonna come across this way then. Can't just cross the river there. It looks like he was defeated. That nah, doesn't matter. Oh, I'll increase their, um, what's it called, their loyalty later, after the war. Hmm. Them raiding all these territories is not good for us. Maybe Munchen should be left next. Laying waste to Zurich. Doesn't matter, it's not owned by anyone. Also, I need to pick up food. Oh, God. Always guys. Oh, what's the called? Defecting. Peasants revolt. Good. So they're not doing too well. They're probably keen to... Oh, what's it called? Um, 
call for peace soon. Okay, who's this? Lord Abu Yaha. What, what's this? It's one of my guys. Wait, I gotta speak to John. Okay, I wanna make myself the Lord of Basil. Yes. We don't need any more volunteers. What else is new? Marketplace, that's it. Mm. It has a chance of spoiling, but whatever. It'll increase morale. I should go to the tavern to get the prostitute as well. 100 dinars is nothing. Sell off those captives as well. Make a little bit of extra cash. Now this place should be making a decent amount of money per week. So let's go check up on that. Set it to low. Because I want it to grow. Um, but it's time to get some more money out of them. Let's set it to medium. It's 2,000 dinars in there. There's nothing left to build here. So they don't need the money. But I'll leave it with them for now. More, there's actually quite a few of them there. I probably could defeat them though, if we'll, if it all goes well, that is. I just want to go to Milan. I don't care about the pirates. Okay, that should keep my guys happy for a while. Because I think of this, you can send gifts as well. Use that to increase their relations. I don't know how much, how many points extra it gives. I think it's two, but I'm not sure for certain. They're running away from me. Why? Oh, come on. We just got there. Why are they raiding? These guys aren't wounded or anything. There's nearly 400 of them. No, nearly 500. If I could just split them up. They want me to sell off this guy. I have to accept it or to lose honor. Just want to keep an eye on these guys. Why the fuck are they... Son of a bitch. Okay, they're raiding this. Who is? Oh crap, I don't know which one. I think it's Rudolph. Jeez, if they've got 500 men, then that's outnumbering me two... Hang on, there's only four of them there. They have about 400 men. I just weigh out my odds. I'm gonna call for another campaign. I need my guys to get over here and help me with this. I could have sworn they had another army, but whatever. Around Basil. It's fucking stupid, but whatever. Going into exile within the Roman Empire, so that means we have a guy that we can... Uh, I don't care about Brescia. Um, we can hire another guy. Podesta Uberto da Bund whatever. Podesta Uberto. All right. Who's this? No, that's my guy. Why isn't he following me? Um. Okay. So. Give him. Uh, let's see. Give him Asti. There we go. Okay, so if we have a look now, Lord Saberta is 
not particularly happy with me. It's not that bad. Can fix in time. Alright. But now we've got another ally at least. Follow me, bitch. We need to fucking save that town. Oh, you've only got seven men. Ah, oh, you're not going to be of much use. Okay, they want peace. I don't think we're in a position to dictate peace terms, so I'm just going to accept it. It gains me right to rule, and... Gives us time to consolidate these territory. Oh, that's great. With them... You know what, could you guys fuck off now? Whatever, finish your raid and piss off. Alright, I'm end the campaign now. That's all I wanted to, to do. Okay, now we're still at war with the uh, the Teutonic Order, but they're so far away that it just doesn't seem either convenient to go fight them or convenient for them to come over here. I mean, I did see some of their soldiers here before, but nothing major. I'm supposing that eventually they'll ask for peace, because they're, they're at war with a lot of people as well. It doesn't look like it's going too well for them. I don't know why they would have declared war on me. You'd think it'd just be neighbours. So now what? I think we should go and uh, fight in some arenas. Send some tournaments. I need to find out where they are, though. Granada, Rome. Okay, good. Go to Rome. One of the problems with taking these settlements is that it's no longer going to allow for um, tournaments to show up. Unless I get married and organize my own tournaments, which I could do. I prefer to marry into my... Someone with the, got my own subjects. Uh, it doesn't really matter if those guys are deserting me now. I don't really need the troops. Who's this? Ransom broker? Yeah, well, since I'm here. So it's good. We got peace with the Holy Roman Empire. They probably just... They've got other shit to worry about. Even though we kind of had them by the balls, I didn't really want to take any more settlements right now. We've got to kind of expand too quickly. And this also gives us time to grow up the fertility or what's it called, the prosperity of the area. And uh, make more money. Because money is what we need to assault or to, uh, to take on anyone. I have to wait until morning anyway. Alright, who's in this tournament? Looks like five of them. Should be easy enough. Because my guys are easy enough to beat. But then again, at this stage, so are these guys. I really need to see if I can get myself a better bow. Not that this bow doesn't serve me well, but... I don't know, if I get something better... I mean, I've got the money for it. Something that can get me one hit kills instead of two hit kills. I'm starting to think maybe my next target should actually be taking Rome. I mean, it's hard to call yourself the Roman Empire if you don't even have Rome. Or, or Ravenna. One thing that we can do to uh, increase the loyalty of our guys is actually make them martial. Since we're at relative peace, it doesn't really matter if they're organizing buddy shit. As soon as we're at war with someone of our neighbors again, I'll take them off martial and then hand it back to myself.
tell you what, this extra bit of armor is really making a big, big difference in these tournaments. Also, same with the extra hit points. Next level up, I can get another level of, uh, another point of iron skin. We're good to just, I don't know, might take half a blow. Helps get me in the fight just that little bit extra longer. But what I really need is for, um, what's his face, Nestor to gain levels up and gain more surgery points. Motherfuckers. Oh, what the piece of shit, Pope Alexander the dick. That's the only guy that ever beats me. I think that was easy enough. But if we look here, where is he, Pope? He's already lost three battles, so it doesn't matter that he that he beat me once. So the other only person that's even close to me is Tycon. But he's easy to beat. However, this guy here, I gave him my old armor, so you can see that's what I used to wear. So it's pretty good, but still, he's not that high of a level yet, so it's pretty easy to knock out. And I made myself a bit of money, not heaps. Mm, I guess we don't have enough space for mercenaries. Plenty of food here, I'll take all of that. Give me a faster horse. No, that's still not recovered. Step horse, those are great. So if we go to notes now, and we go to factions, where am I? Uh, Roman Empire. Roman Empire is at war with Ordo Teutonicus, and Truce looks by there. Recently suffered provocation by subjects of the Republica. Interesting. Aren't these guys defeated? Suffered provocation by subjects of the Roman uh, by the Republic of Di Venezia. I guess that means that if I want to, I can go to war with them. Well, let's think about that before doing it. I mean, we've got 19 days left of peace before the Holy Roman Empire even can declare war on us. I'm not exactly in bad shape. I mean, we've got to take even more of Italy. I mean, that's owned by Venice, so is that. We could conquer this area here. I'm not sure if I want to come down here, though, because then it'll put us in border of Hungary. Rome has only got this one region here. We could essentially destroy the uh, papacy, which, as you all know, I really don't care for. Majorly concerned about France. How are we going? What's our, uh, what's it called? Um, my tool, 72. So that's pretty good now. People should be showing me a little bit of respect. If I don't act on this provocation, I'll... some of my guys are going to be unhappy with me for it. So that is the question, whether or not we actually do that. Now if I have a look here, my budget... Oh fuck. Why are we not making much money? The fuck, it was at 10% before, and now it's at minus 9%. I, don't, I think this bracket here is a little bit off. I 
I have to add up all of this and see if it is actually 9%. I know I've got a lot of money coming in. What's this? Rents from Basil. Alright. That's, that's a fair amount of money, though. Yeah, but you look at something like Milan. It doesn't pay for its upkeep. Neither does this. Neither does that. Strasbourg. Let me see here. Oh, shit. Now, only just pays for its own garrison. I'm not sure if I want to keep Strasbourg. But i got to wait for a lord to give it away. I don't have time to keep reading this. i just got to keep checking on it. On the city to see if there's anyone... Anyone new? Why are you just sitting there, you dumb shit? Guess he's just trying to regenerate his troops. Looks like he must have lost a battle recently. Or fairly recently. Also, we're not making any money from that, so... Yeah, I guess the region's quite poor. That doesn't help. The tax inefficiency seems pretty bad as well. I mean, that's six grand. That's a lot of money. Question is, though, do we or do we not declare war on Venice? Hard question to ask. I mean, we just haven't consolidated it all yet, but there's got provocation. I think we'll let it slide. There is something I wanted to find out. So, Lord Abu Yaha is there. I want to send him a gift to see how much exactly gifts provide in um, uh, bonuses. So, if I go to the. to. where is it? You? Nope. Go to you, Chancellor. Please send a gift to person, a lord, to some wine. Where is he? Oh, within Roman Empire, to Abu Yaha. I'm sending it to him because he's right here. So it won't take long to get here. So I think it's 150 wine, which is three lots of it. So it increases by three. It's not too bad. It's basically a bit of a bribe. I mean, my, wine's not that hard to find. See, there's some wine. It's not enough. So it's about 600 it costs. Well, it depends on where you get it from. Then again, I got an idea. I've got a winery. I have to wait until morning, though. I've got a winery here at Manor of Verona. Instead of them paying me money, what if I got them to pay me in goods instead. And every so often I'll just check here, rather than me having to go buy the wine, I can actually just go make it. Oh, oh shit. I need to wait till it's better than... It needs to be early morning or not just dawn. There we go. Problem is though, i got to find the guy. Much better coming in on this Arabian horse. Much faster. Can't kill anyone in this though. Uh, pottery. Baker. Yeah, potter. Uh. I never spoke to you. I don't know what you're talking about. This looks like a winery, I'm assuming. Brewer. Provide the tribute in goods. Okay, I want to see my... Oh, this is ale. That actually works the same for me. So, this is ale. Where's the wine dude? Give ale or one. I think it's you. Yep, there you are. Good. Provide tribute and goods. 
more expensive here than the other place. Whatever. Anyway, we'll see how much it actually provides. It might only be one per week, but that's actually still not too bad. What are you? Catholic priest. My men are weary, Father. Would you be so kind as to raise their spirits? Uh, fuck you, I don't want that. I'd like to provide... To en enact a scriptorium. What is that? Ah, okay, that sounds interesting. I'll take that. Father, I seek to repent my sins. Alright, what does this shit do? Let's just go 3,000 dinars. What does that do? Oh, you gain honor. Okay, well, that's actually pretty good. How much honor was that? So, 3,000. I was at 8 before. Just have to leave and find out. I don't see how a tithe is particularly honorable, but whatever. So, I guess it's it's 1,000 per honor. That's not too bad. I really should, uh, like, learn more about these matters. I did Google it, but I didn't find much information. Okay, I think what I'll do now is I'll end the video and just sort of try and consolidate a bit more. Just go around, try and increase the wealth of the area, uh, build up a few more manors, try and read a few books. And make my laws like me, and also hire a few more. And we'll come back when, I don't know, either someone declares war on us or we're ready to, I don't know, uh, attack someone. Anyway, that's the end of this episode, so like and subscribe, part 15 is next, and don't forget to visit me on Facebook. See you next time, fuckers.